jump on here and touch on this particular uh, subject because um, it's a, a subject that's widespreading. Um, I'm going to talk about people who have uh, overdosed on drugs. And it's been a lot of in, in, individuals, uh, some in the entertainment field, some individuals that you know of that have uh, overdosed. And uh, it's more so prevalent now because of a new drug, which is called fentanyl, which is uh, is a is a um, pain reliever. It's a very very uh, serious drug. It's an opiate, and a lot of people use this for uh, cancer and other uh, um, reasons as well. But people are using it on the streets, cutting it with all kinds of other drugs, mix, mixing it with uh, different types of drugs, and it, it, it it's making it lethal and it's killing. A lot of individuals and this is uh, in the wake of uh, two individuals that you probably have and have or have not heard of a uh, rapper by the name of Gangsta Boo from 3-6 Mafia she died due to an apparent overdose and uh, a guy by the name of Big Scar who's like 22 23 is a rapper who uh, uh, was signed with a uh, uh, to a label Gucci Mane but it's not just limited limited to individuals who are uh, rappers, singers, things of that nature. It's just, just people uh, all over the the um, the uh, spectrum that's taking drugs, overdosing, um, not really being cognizant of what you know what these drugs actually do. Now, I'm I'm not you know here to bash anyone. That's not what I'm trying to do. I drink my beer, drink Hennessy on, on occasions. Sometimes of uh, in the past, I've maybe uh, smoking some uh, uh, marijuana. I've uh, not done anything more serious uh, than that. Thank goodness. I mean, I've taken a you know pain pill. But in, anyway, enough about me. It's not about it's it's about not not about me. It's about individuals who actually take uh, several lethal amounts of drugs, not knowing what. You know what it could actually do to you and i understand that uh fentanyl is, is used for pain but the fact that they that that that, that it's killing individuals because of, of individuals not knowing you know the, the how to actually use it and just trying to mix it with all other uh drugs it's, it's actually killing people i've recently lost someone due to cocaine that uh was apparently mixed with uh fentanyl now i have a, a list of individuals who have lost their lives due to an overdose, and it wasn't fitting on, but it was, you know, just just um, not really uh, um, being cognizant of what these drugs actually can do, and just taking it, just taking more of it, more of it, more of it, and then eventually they out of here. Um, Fentanyl just recently came on the market about a couple of years ago, and that seems to be the drug of choice for a lot of individuals. And I uh, and I say. Um, a lot of young individuals, a lot of individuals in the entertainment uh, field who, who mix this particular drug and, and, and want, you know, I don't know what it, what it does to you, but I know for one thing, it's not a good thing. But my thing is, man, look, stick to what you know, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's already so many different types of uh, things out there that people are putting in their bodies from foods to, to just any type of uh, uh, other uh, types of stuff that people are putting into their bodies and then you mixing it with uh, uh, fentanyl and drugs, all kind of uh, different types of drugs and not knowing what it actually can do to you and you want to try it. I don't know if it's because people want a, a, a better high or if you already taking some particular drugs and you just want to reach another high. I don't really know what the situation is, but, 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 but believe me, this fentanyl is taking people out of here. But before I conclude, I just want to mention some individuals who uh, we are aware of that have taken uh, drugs and end up overdosing. I mean, you have to know your limit. That's the thing about it. Be aware of knowing your limit. I mean, if you do any type of these drugs, from cocaine to drinking, whatever the case may be, know your limit. You know, and know what these particular drugs do because the one of you know the effect that it may have on one person, it may not have that same effect on you. So. That's my advice to you if you do, do what you do. You know what I'm saying? So, um, in conclusion, because like I said, I just wanted to come on here and, and you know, and just talk about this uh, 
fentanyl epidemic that's just pill that's just been killing individuals, you know. And, and like I said, I lost some friends to this particular drug as well. Just I want to just mention individuals in the in the mix of overdosing on drugs that people have heard of, from like Michael Jackson to Prince to Gangsta Boo, as I mentioned earlier, to Mac Miller to Dana Plato to um, people like Bobby Brown Jr. Um, we've lost. Um, Shock G, uh, um, who else? Ma uh, that's it, Mac Miller, um, uh, Whitney Houston, Heath Ledger, um, Chris Farley, and um, Janis Joplin. You know, you know, uh, in, in the earlier years. I mean, the list goes on and on, and it just surprised me to to find out. At least this this is like about maybe seven or eight, nine, ten people that I mentioned to you who have lost their lives due to overdose. There's more that it just surprised me to find out that these many people have lost, you know, have, have checked out of here due to actually overdosing, taking too much of could kill you, overdosing on drugs. So like I say, man, watch out for what you do, man. Um, like I say, this fent fentanyl epidemic is real. I don't do any hard, hard drugs like that. I don't advocate it. But if you do, definitely, man, know what the effects are. Um, I guess that's just about that's about it. That's all I want to come and tell you. And, and this is just a, like a, you know, a brief moment I want to share with you all, considering the fact that, man, you know, I really would like for you all to be a, around long to come. And I'm out.